Turning now to developing news, voters in Beverly Hills are deciding the fate of an ultra exclusive new hotel backed by the world's richest man. And those who oppose this project are concerned about overdevelopment and a lack of affordable housing. Supporters say it would bring in millions of tax revenue and attract more businesses to the area. KTLA 5's Lauren Lister has more on the vote. Hi there, voters casting ballots here in a special election that will determine the fate of a hotel project slated for Rodeo Drive. It's from luxury company LVMH, run by Bernard Arnault, the world's richest man. A battle over this corner of the famed Rodeo Drive. Plans currently are for construction of a hotel from luxury leader LVMH, Louis Vuitton Moet Hennessy. This is a luxury hotel, one of the finest luxury hotels in the world and it augments this the luxury that is Rodeo Drive. The exclusive Cheval Blanc is planned for Rodeo in Little Santa Monica, a hotel with up to 115 rooms with a members club, retail, restaurants and spa already approved by the city, which projects it would deliver major tax revenue, $725 million over 30 years. But whether it moves forward is now up to a Democratic vote. I'm glad that the referendum is happening. I think citizens should have their say also. Beverly Hills residents like this one casting ballots to determine if the hotel project will be stopped. The LA Times reports behind the referendum, a small group of residents concerned with overdevelopment and a larger effort by an outside union, Unite Here Local 11, that collected the signatures to force this special election. The union has no business in our business. And there are residents who really do oppose this, and I respect that. The union represents hospitality workers and reportedly objects in part because the project doesn't specifically earmark money for affordable housing. This woman voted against the project. Here's why. Traffic and the promises of all this money simply are promises. She feels promises can be broken or fail to pan out. This voter weighing the pros and cons. The key thing for the city is the revit, tax revenue. That's and but on the other side, you know, it's going to create congestion. Some elected city officials I spoke to who support the hotel believe it reflects the future of Beverly Hills. What gives us this wonderful quality of life that gives us this incredible police department, fire department, schools, safe, beautiful city is very often the business tax. And this to me really represents supporting our residential community and our business community. And it's visionary. Voters are being asked two things, whether they approve the zoning and the development agreements for the hotel project. If either fail, the project won't move forward. As for the cost of the special election, the city says LVMH is set to reimburse them. I also reached out to that union, Unite Here Local 11. Haven't heard back yet. In Beverly Hills, I'm Lauren Lister, KTLA 5 News.